Hey folks, Joe here. So just yesterday I uploaded a video uh, talking about this tent that I just got. And now we're going to get her all set up. get the tent set up, make sure everything's uh, here that should be, no missing parts. Going out on a trip with the tent in uh, about three days. Here's the tent set up, fly sheets on, doors are zipped closed, it's mostly staked out, certainly not guyed out obviously, but I'm not going to bother with that here today. Back up here. And next we'll open up the doors and uh, check out the inside. Okay folks, switch cameras, and here's the new tent set up, Eureka El Capitan 2. I'm just walk around it a little bit here. Get both doors opened up right now. Go back around the other side. And I take my shoes off and get inside. Up here. Zip out panels on the roof for ventilation, leave them closed up when it's uh, cold weather time. And we are well into the second half of October. Same thing, another panel over here on this side. So you can really open this up, get lots of ventilation in it. And there's a little clip for uh, when you have the venting opened up. You can roll it up, keep it out of the way. Let's see, what else do we want to talk about here? Pockets in the corner. All four corners with pockets. I'm just going to shut down the camera for a second, close up one of the doors, and we'll take a look at that. Okay, so we got one door closed up here now. And as you can see, there's also panels here to open up the door. I got it partially opened here now just to give you an idea. You can get lots of ventilation in the summer, the warmer times of the year. The zipper all closed for the cooler times of the year. 
Uh, room with a view. So here I am in the tent, and uh, we're well into the second half of October. It is Sunday afternoon, and I was going to go into detail on the tent here in this video, but I'm going to keep this one pretty simple. I'm heading out for a camping trip in about three days, possibly two, two to three days, something like that. And while I have it set up out in the uh, the woods somewhere, it's nice. I'll do a more detailed video talking about the tent and all of that. Uh, the camping trip. What trip am I doing, you ask? Glad you asked. The trip I'm doing is either a sea kayak trip out on Lake Superior between Thunder Bay and the U.S.-Canada border. Uh, some shoreline camping, a little bit of time out on the island, stuff like that. And that's the one I'm leaning towards doing. I'll make the final decision probably tomorrow. Tomorrow. The other option is about a week-long bicycle touring trip here in northwestern Ontario. It's one or the other. Probably would do the kayak trip. Uh, leaving Th Thunder Bay very soon. So I would like to get another paddling trip in out on Lake Superior before I go. And that's one of the reasons I just bought this here tent. And, uh, well... Well, you'll be seeing lots of this tent in videos soon, uh, especially as we get into next month, November, and some uh, colder temperatures as well. Anyways, I'll be heading to Manitoba soon and uh, hopefully do some winter adventures there. Get out in the tent there, might do some backpacking. I'd like to do the Manterio Trail, but I don't know if that'll happen this fall. If not, then probably next summer. Though so that's when we get into the bad bugs, but hey, we'll see. Anyways, I'm gonna stop yakking here. I shut this camera off and uh, Throw together a short video and I'll snap a couple more photos here as well.